So we can't do Renala's Divine Tower yet, which is unfortunate. We can't do the Black Blade yet. Oh, actually, you know what? Before we go up to Altus, that actually reminds me that before we go up to Altus, sorry to fucking blue ball you like that, let's go to that red gate that uh, the Roman Grecian man marked on our map. Let's go there first. So I'm going in the complete opposite direction of it right now, so I need to turn around. And I need to head up that way somewhere. But I don't know how far or where I have to go. Looks like it's not too far off though. It looks like it's like right up there, maybe. Where's it in here? This is the gate. This is the gate that I took when I first played the game. This is the gate that took me to Kaled. And you're gonna see exactly what I was talking about. You end up right in front of the Black Blade Kindred. It's fucking ridiculous. See, he's right fucking there, dude. At least it has the courtesy and dignity to spawn you behind him so you don't have to aggro him right away. But I didn't know how bad he was gonna be, so I went up and spanked him in the booty. And he turned around and uh, spanked me in the booty pretty hard. In fact, arguably, I would say he spanked me in the booty 50 times harder than I spanked him. Let's meet Gronk. I just gave you four, greedy fuck. Okay, we just got a ton of stuff from Garonk. Not sated. Feed me more death. Okay. Right, so. Let's unlock this side of grace, because we may be coming back here in the future. Let's not rest at it, however. Because I'm pretty sure if you rest at it, something very nasty happens. And I really don't feel like dealing with that today. So let's go back now to the Grand Lift of Dectus. Also, I just realized that those Iron Maidens are holding a baby. They are cradling a baby while they hit you with Hellraiser size. Not very safe. Lack of good parenting. You could at least have a bumper sticker that says baby on board. I don't know. So when we went to Altus Plateau, we didn't go the boring way. We didn't take the elevator. We actually ran and did the whole cavern and fought the magma worm. But this is the other way that you're supposed to get to Altus. And this is the naturally progressive way, I think. But for the people that don't find the medallions to be able to activate the lift, they actually give an optional path to be able to get there. Which I think is really cool. So granted that the game is incredibly highly open-ended, they account for people maybe not exploring in the direction of this one key item to get you to this one key pivotal place that you need to access. So that's pretty cool. Right? Welcome again to the Altus Plateau. Don't mind these guys, they're just there to look scary. They're not really all that deadly though. They're kinda nerds. They're just doormen. They're like, mm, go ahead. We have the fucking stupid stone ancient wristband so they just let us through. Okay, so this is where we're headed. We're headed down there to that Ever Jail, but I need to figure out how to get down there, and I don't remember. I could have sworn, like, the way I found this. And I didn't find this until my... Fucking, I want to say, like, 50th or 60th, 70th, 80th hour in Elden Ring. I didn't find this for a very long time. Um, and then I saw somebody else fight it, and I was like, what? I was like, where'd you find that at? And they're like, oh, it's in the back of Altus or whatever. And I was like, what? And, uh, I came back here, down here and dropped down the rocks, and, uh, yeah, sure enough. 
So we're going to go see a friendly old codger that we haven't seen in a very long time, if I remember correctly. And uh, it's time for some much, much needed revenge. Straight from out of the retirement home, in this corner, Godfroy the Grafted. <laughs> it's basically Godfroy. Just again, you know, because why not? Let's try it, Pansy. Enjoy your poison, idiot. Go ahead, I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck about that. I don't care about that. I'm gonna have some throwing knives, bitch. I don't give a fuck about that. That I mildly give a fuck about. Damn, he hurts. He fucking hurts pretty bad. I'm not gonna lie. Come on, them wussy. Bring it on, bitch. Oh, man, I thought I rolled that, dude. Holy shit. That is so much less delayed than I thought. Okay, I gotta keep that in mind. Really? Oof. Right, I gotta be careful with him. There we go. Much better. Nice. Bonk. So those ground slams are not intended to be rolled. They're intended to be jumped. That was the mistake that I was making with them before. It's good to know. It's good to learn. I rolled that. Come on, dude. I would not have allowed that wind blast to just smack me in the face like that. Good roll. Capitalize. Wombo combo. Get the fuck away from that. You ain't Falco! Fuck away from the wombo. That's gonna suck. Oh, it's not gonna suck. Wow, surprisingly, the game was incredibly lenient right there. I'll take it. you old bitch. Try that on for size, motherfucker. Ooh! Alright, okay. Fair enough. Talk shit, get hit. That's fine. It's okay. It's just a broken spine. I'll live. Possibly. Maybe I won't. Fight's not over. Shoot. I really want to learn how to roll that entire thing. That'd be so cool to learn. Damn. Uh. Can't see what you're doing. It's a lot of wind. Shoop. Shoop. Good. Rah! Okay, that, that was very anticlimactic, but either way, get it, you old bitch. Easy. Godfrey Icon. What is that? What does that do? What the fuck is that for? Charge spells and skills? I don't give a fuck. I don't care. What the fuck am I gonna do with that? Okay, we take those. I would say that was well earned. I would say I adapted pretty good on that fight, actually. I think that's one of my better ones this entire fucking playthrough, actually. Not bad. Not bad at all. Okay, so. Somewhere, roaming this Altus Plateau, there's a boss that I never, ever fought. So there's a boss that I have, therefore, never ever seen. There's also another boss that I have never ever fought, and therefore have never ever seen, and I did not know it existed either. So I was thinking before we end off stream today, let's go tackle one of two of those two bosses. And maybe we'll do a cavern. Unless that happens. If that happens, we might die. 
I did not know what area of Vaultus I was in. And I'm just constantly reminded of how much every area in this game sucks absolute balls. Actually, you know what? There's two things we can do this stream. Tell you what. Let's go fight the first of one of two of those bosses, and we'll save the other for next time around. Because I don't want to do them both right away. Because I feel like that would be boring. Fuck that guy. That guy's a piece of shit. I'm not worried about that guy right now. Let me get to a place where I can warp. There's a boss here. And there's a boss here. So I don't want to do the hero's grave right now. But I do want to make my way up to that minor urn tree, I think. Now, the thing about this guy is I don't know exactly where he is. So this might take a little bit of exploration before I find him. But I know he's in this general area somewhere. I just don't know where. Okay, here's the Erd tree, so he's got to be close to here somewhere. Oh, this is a bridge. It isn't the Erd tree at all. I'm just stupid. Okay, I'm really far away from him. I was going the completely wrong direction of the Erd Tree. I'll know him when I see him. I think I'll know him when I see him. There's the Erd Tree. Okay. There he is. Enter Worm Face. I have never fought this thing before. I did not even know that this thing was a thing. So this is going to be an interesting one. He topples trees. Of course. Yeah. Also hits incredibly fucking hard. Understand? That's bullshit. Hey man, could you kill some of these guys so we could have a one-on-one -on -one here? Come on, Chief, do you mind? Ow. Damn, he shot that hella far. God damn, that does a lot of build-up, too. Okay, I gotta be really careful with this guy, then. Alright, so I'm thinking let's take a Crab Rangoon, just in case he happens to hit me again. Let's summon Latena. I really don't think I need her, but I do think she'll serve as a great distraction for the Death Breath. Oh my god, how many grabs are you going to do, chief? Holy fucking shit, man. You going to put me down? Ow, dude. Oh, fuck. I need to get out of that. I'm not going to lie, dude. That fucking grab spam was atrociously poor. That was so bad. I rolled like four or five of those, fine. And like the fifth one grabbed me. It's like, holy shit. I'm really glad I took that physical reduction. If I hadn't, that might have been it for us. Oh, he's gonna grab spam again, isn't he? Oh, come on! No way! No way did that grab me. I don't care what the fuck you say. That did not grab me. Yeah, you can get the fuck out of here, dude. I'm sorry, that did not grab me. You can suck my fucking dick. I was on the edge of your ankle. Wow, man. Alright, it's good to know I wasn't really missing anything out of the Elden Ring experience with that boss. That was kind of shit. Crimson Spill Crystal Tear and a Speckled Hard Tear. Okay, I've never seen those before. I don't know what those do. Still a first try. Thanks, Latana. Appreciate the hard carry. That was pretty fucking bad. I'm not gonna hold you. That was kind of a shit boss. That was really underwhelming. That being said, that being out of the way, let's go make our way to the Shaded Ruins. Or the Shaded Castle moreover. Let me delete this marker so I know I never have to do that ever again, and I don't have to go there at all. Let's go to the Shaded Castle. 